you can have the best services and business in the world, but if no one knows you exist, you won't make any sales, right? So in the past couple of years, I've gone from social media zero with no audience, never being on social media, to running a successful global brand with clients in countries around the world, right? And so now I'm sharing several ways to throw your visibility through the roof so that you can get seen and you can get sales, okay? If you're new here, I just want to quickly introduce myself. I'm Katie Fearhurst, and I'm the admin of Successful Women Building Generational Wealth, and I want to welcome you here to Lunch Break Live. And if you're new here on the YouTube channel, welcome. You may want to hit like and subscribe because we do free trainings here every single week. And also, if you are interested in being featured on Lunch Break Live and having all of this exposure for your business, give us some free trainings, please reach out to me and we can discuss, okay? Now, there's a little formula I was taught by my coaches that has really worked for me, okay? This has helped me grow and now scale my business, okay? And the formula is V plus C equals P. So that's visibility plus credibility equals profitability. Now, credibility, that's your brand, your relationships, your story, your offers, okay? All the things that we think about when it comes to, you know, getting online and getting sales online, okay? Credibility happens when you, like, walk your talk and you follow through on the promises, you know, and everything that you said you were going to do. But it's also about, like, your character and creating that know, like, and trust with your audience, right? Credibility is what turns your followers into lifelong customers, but it doesn't work without, you know, that other part of the equation that I was talking about, right? Now, you can have a ton of visibility, a huge following, and even a mile-long email list, but if you have no credibility with your audience, you're going to struggle to make those sales. So, both sides of this equation are equally important, but today I'm just wanting to talk about the V because that's what you voted on and share lots of ways to help you get more visibility. <clears throat> I preach this over and over again, and Pau just said this as well, create a freebie funnel. This may not sound like a visibility tip, but it really is. A freebie funnel is where you create that valuable resource that you give to your audience for free in exchange for their name and for their email list, okay? And one of the secrets to visibility online and create, is creating that sense of everywhere they go, there you are, right? No matter where your potential clients are looking, you want them to be reminded of you and your business. And there's no place no better place to do this, right, than to use a freebie funnel and get them onto your email list, okay? I could go on and on about the value of building an email list versus only showing up on social media. In fact, I created a whole training about it that you can watch on YouTube. It's about how to increase your sales by 90%, and I linked that video in the description as well. You can watch that after. But if you don't know this, you only see about two to three percent of your followers, um, I'm sorry, only about two to three percent of your followers will see any of your social media posts that you publish, okay? Now, when you compare that to 20 to 25 percent of email subscribers who won't just see your email, but they'll actually open it and they'll read it and they'll click on it, now you can see how email is easily going to 10x your visibility, okay? That's why the next tip is to email your list frequently. Don't just build that email list, communicate with them. We often get so focused on growing our audience that we forget about the audience. 
So whether your email list has five people or 5,000 people on it, you need to make yourself visible to them by communicating on a regular basis, okay? Number three is scary to a lot of people, but it's video. And video is one of the best ways to build that know, like, and trust factor with your audience. And it can also pull double duty and increase your visibility and your credibility at the same time, okay? And then the next three visibility tips are where to use the video, okay? There's TikTok, there's Instagram Reels, and there's Facebook Reels. And unfortunately for some of us who are severely camera shy, we are living in the age of short video. It has been proven that this is not just a passing fad. Short video is here to stay. <clears throat> to increase your visibility on TikTok, Instagram Reels, and Facebook Reels, commit to that value-based posting strategy where you educate, you inspire, and you also entertain your ideal clients and customers, right? Because people come to social media, they want to look good, they want to feel good or they want to be feel or they want to feel seen and they want to feel understood okay so consistently sharing educational tips or words of encouragement with your ideal clients and customers and then like letting them into your world by taking them behind the scenes and showing them what you do every day in your business with that lifestyle type content where they can really relate to you that is going to skyrocket your visibility Okay, now short video, right? The short video that I'm talking about is currently the fastest way to increase your visibility online. But now let's also talk about long form video using this little known platform called YouTube. YouTube is owned by Google, which in case you didn't know, is the largest search engine platform in the world. So by creating just one video a week that you publish to your YouTube channel, you can increase your visibility, not just today, but for years to come. And one of the things about YouTube is that you can create that evergreen content and that can generate leads today or two, three, four, or even 10 years from now, okay? The traffic on YouTube is based off of search. So let's say you're in the nutrition niche and you create a video on how to make healthy and kid-friendly dinners in 30 minutes a day. You can use that video to generate leads on YouTube, whether someone is searching for this kind of content today or if they're searching in 10 years from now, okay? That's a huge reason why I stream these lives to YouTube as well as to Facebook, okay? Next is to be consistent. This may not sound like a visibility tip, but trust me, it is. By being consistent, you will set yourself apart from like 95% of your competition. Because people have to see your message anywhere from five to 12 times before they're ready to actually act on it and opt into your funnel or make a purchase. So by being consistent, you're not only increasing your chance of getting in front of those new followers, but you're staying in front of your current followers so they will become buyers much quicker. All right. This one I love, collaborate with others in your niche. Or even better, collaborate with those in a complementary niche, like with an audience that's similar to yours, okay? Podcast interviews, Instagram lives, Facebook lives, YouTube lives, mentions in blog posts, sharing of your content, um, creating affiliate links so that other people can share your links, right? Um, jumping on a webinar, or even being a guest trainer in someone else's course or program, okay? Collaboration is one of the best ways to leverage the audience of other people to grow your own. And the best way to be successful is to help others be successful. That is really win-win, okay? And now there's also paid advertising to increase your visibility. Whether you're running actual ads or if you're spending $5 a day to like boost an Instagram post to an audience of your ideal clients and customers, 
Doing this, you're able to grow your following without any extra time spent on your end. Now, if you have more time than you have budget to invest in paid ads, then this next strategy is for you, okay? And this is something I learned about a year ago. Engage with Instagram accounts within your niche. Choose five to 10 accounts that are similar to yours and who have more than like 10,000 or so followers. Visit one of their recent posts, jump down in the comment section and click on the profile of one of the people who commented. If their profile is public and they look like someone who might be an ideal follower of yours, then like three of their posts, comment on two, and then you can also follow them if you want to. And you wanna do this with about 10 accounts a day or double it if you really wanna grow fast. This strategy can add dozens of followers a week for free. And you know they could become potential customers because they're already engaging with accounts that are similar to yours. Next is to create a value-driven Facebook group like this one. This strategy is huge because Facebook is operating more and more like a search engine, which means when you set your group up correctly, Facebook will actually recommend it to your ideal clients, okay? More on how to do this, right? I, I have a video about this one that I'll link below as well about how to use your Facebook group for your business. The video is about seven months old, but I checked it and the information is still relevant, okay? Another way to increase your visibility is to host a giveaway inside your Facebook group where members invite their friends in exchange for contest entries. We got our first 1,000 members in this group using this strategy. We had um, a $100 Amazon gift card as the prize. It was very, very exciting, right? So let me know if you're competitive and if you want me to do this contest again because I wanna know how many people are interested in that. The next three strategies are all similar. I want to break them down all at once for you because they're all pretty much the same. The next, that is to do a free challenge, a workshop, or a webinar, okay? And there's so many ways that you can do this, whether you can host them in a, in a pop-up Facebook group, um, this webinar broadcast rooms, or even just on your public profile, okay? And you can even boost these by incentivizing your viewers for showing up and sharing your challenge, your workshop, or your webinar with other people. You can offer prizes for tagging a friend, or if you're using an opt-in page, invite users to share the challenge, workshop, or webinar with a friend by putting a simple share button on the thank you page, okay? Because say you have like 100 people participating in your event. If they each share with one person, you have instantly doubled your visibility. Visibility is important, but it doesn't always mean more sales. If you wanna see the exact formula I used to go from social media zero with no audience to scaling a global brand, then I invite you to check out my six figure biz in six weeks free class. Inside I share the four steps you should be taking if you wanna grow a six figure biz that will also allow you time and location freedom because that's what we're all here for. You can find it in my link tree and I'll link it below in the video description as well.